Oof, it's just like causing me pain watching this. I'm not even joking. So as you guys know, Ludwig uh, did a 1,000 buckets challenge. Took him like seven hours to get a thousand successful three-point shots off. He shot around like 28%, if I recall correctly. But that was just straightforward. You know what I mean? In 50 shot increments, he 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 went through, boom, boom, boom. Did it over the course of seven hours. Now I thought because he did it, and you know I was unfamiliar with his game because he was able to do it, and because the shots like kind of ass. He's not like great at shooting in general. I thought. Personally, he would, uh, I mean, I'd be able to do this with ease. It turns out, though, the 1,000 three-point challenge has nothing to do with basketball at all. Any comments for the Redditor saying shooting 1,000 shots is easy? Yeah, they're wrong. I will I will stand on that. Ludwig st stood on his business. And I will tell you why. Because I've shot 100 three-pointers before. I shot almost, I shot 100 successful three-pointers before we started the challenge. I thought to myself, oh, this is easy. There is a very big difference between 100 successful three points and 500 and 600 and 700. Cause like, it's not even necessarily the stamina for everyone's body. Everyone's bodies are different. Everyone's endurance is different. I thought my weak ass knees would give out way before. I'm kind of shocked that my knees were strong the entire time. My legs are fine. Everything is fine in my body right now. I feel a little muscle soreness in my shoulders, a little muscle soreness in my triceps, yada, yada, yada my legs but that's fine that's just regular old muscle soreness but i up my wrist the way that i shoot with my wrist flick in comparison to the way ludwig shoots he apparently had some serious issues with his forearms down here that was the big issue there were a lot of problems as far as like going back to it there were a lot of problems as far as like uh the way i should have prepared for it i just kind of went into it like a dude would casually decide to run a marathon you know what i mean thinking that oh well i run you know i'm 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 a pretty solid runner i'm in phenomenal shape let me just go do a marathon real quick and just like run the entire time you can complete it and um you know some people do that every now and then my trainers have done that before but then they get cooked the next day so that's what it is it's like being in good shape and then being like i'm just going to do an ultra marathon so that was the issue um because this wasn't basketball at all it was more so it was more so a marathon it was more so like an ultra marathon, as a matter of fact. Even Kobe would only take 400 a day. Yeah. Unmuting now. Will you ever reattempt the challenge? What if you and Ludwig did it at the same time on opposite ends of a court? That could be fun, but I don't know if I'd be do. I, I don't know if I'd do it again. I'm gonna be honest with you, because like my wrists uh, have not recovered, and like the pain is still very much there. My right wrist is a little bit better. It comes and goes, but even when I open my hand like this right now, it hurts especially if I open it even further, especially on the thumb side, it hurts a lot. So I am going to uh, maybe hold off on doing it again anytime soon. Obviously, the major goal here was to do a fundraiser. And we did that. And I'm very happy that this community was on board with it. We were able to raise uh, $100,000 for MAP, Medical Aid for Palestine, Heal Palestine and UNRWA, which is very exciting. That was the overarching goal. And also, it seemed like it was a lot of fun, too. It was a lot of fun to watch, which is, those are my two, like, obviously, the number one goal was I would, you know, defeat Ludwig. But beyond that, I obviously wanted to, one, put together a fun thing for you guys to watch and also be able to fundraise on top of that. And it seems like it worked. And a big part of that, of course, was the many different wonderful people that came through and participated. And it made me really happy. You and your delirious day was gold. Yeah, I was, I, I definitely got delirious by the end of it. Shouts out to the roomies, Blau, Elam, Valkyrie, Leslie, Marat showed up. Shouts out to the entire production team as always. That was phenomenal. Morgan put an incredible thing together. Can I have my donation refunded? You didn't complete the challenge. No, I did do all the challenges technically. I just didn't, I was not able to shoot the proper amount of buckets partially because I would have continued by the way if we if they didn't kick us out it would have taken me 10 hours though let's be real I would have just kept lobbing it up grandma style because that shit was working what was the ball court fiasco with timing there was no ball court fiasco or anything like that it was just they uh, it's a high school so they we had it for a limited amount of time most importantly though I will admit I think I look pretty f brolic so that's what's important you know what I mean? Another goal of mine was to ensure that I 
had at least a decent shot, a decent looking shot mechanically, and also looked brolic while doing it. I think the incredibly hot gym didn't help as far as my cramping and whatnot. Blind swoosh. Yeah. Yeah. See, before he quits. Oh, that almost no, dropped. That, that was by, good. Like, Whatever you did right memory, there. He'll make like this is yeah. like, Yo, this oh! Yeah, I couldn't even tell. Like, I that's the funniest part. I just, I couldn't tell at all whether I was making him or not. Because those drunk goggles are deadly, dude. And he'll make, like, this is yeah. two. Like, Yo, this and, oh! I feel like you did the granny shots. You got your rhythm. You were doing pretty good without getting three pointers. Yeah, I know. The yesterday's total calorie point overall, like, my entire body calorie burn was 9,000 calories. Like, 9,400, I think. Toe on the line, bitch. I had, I I had a blindfold on. What are you talking about? I don't know where I'm shooting from. Plus, I mean, it doesn't seem like it's on the line. So shut the fuck up. I jumped. Losing the load is a lifelong L, but you push yourself hard and raise a lot of money. Good stuff, Unk. Yeah. So the thing is, the thing is, I'm so glad I at least played him and beat him. If I hadn't one v one him in my weakest moment when I was like literally in cramping every time i'm every time i activated any muscle whatsoever slash couldn't use my hands at all if i could not beat him in that situation i would have probably been kind of sad i'll be honest you think you could hit 1000 threes if you had more time yeah, probably but i would just have to granny it the entire time oh this is the game winning game point nine thousand calories down i still had too much size on ludwig bro i you can see my movements are so slow because i'm dying okay playing like luca bro that's how it that's how it works bro this when you're a big boy <laughs> The quick one scuffed 1v1 stat line. Hassan Piker, seven points, 14 rebounds, one block, one steal. Field goal attempts, I had 30. Ludwig had 21. I had seven points. Ludwig had three. Three-point attempts, seven. Ludwig, 16. Ludwig attempted 16 three-pointers. That's crazy. That's the stat sheet. He even blocked me, which was pretty cool. Ludwig is actually, Ludwig has gotten a, a lot better. Like, think about it this way. <laughs> yeah, obviously, I was dead and uh, you know it's not it's not my best performance <laughs> like if i'm not dying i would definitely cook mother it's not even a thing but like still even then ludwig did a really good job i am very proud of him he has gotten a lot a lot a lot better and it's not even like uh it's not even something i reluctantly admit i'm i'm proud of him i'm happy that he's like played a lot more basketball since the last time we played and he's got a lot better <laughs> Nowinski back to the post. He's got no range. There's a dog on the court. <laughs> Using his body here. Finds the post. The oh. fact that you're making me post up means you're getting better, though. The left hand finishes are unexpected. No, my left is lethal. I have a pretty decent left hand, I would say. Like, for my size uh, and, and not being, like, uh, an actual basketball player at all. Look at that. Look at that beautiful, look at that beautiful left hand. That's some Kyrie shit right there. Will Neff is a good ass friend, to be honest. Yeah. Your height plays a huge factor in you winning. If you, yeah, no shit, dude. What are you talking about? Of course. And the fact that I even had to post up on him means that I was like dying at that point. Here, I'll tell you what I can do well. I can shoot from the top of the key pretty reliably. I have a decent fadeaway shot. I can shoot from top of key and like mid range pretty well. And I have a decent like spin move in the post. I couldn't do any of that stuff at this point. You have to remember, I'm literally dead at this point. This is the end. This is 700 buckets. I've already burned like 9,000 calories at this point. You're, you're out of your mind. You know what I mean? I was like, this is a zombie game for me. Unless they're like actual professional trained athletes. So um, I would say so start up here. The they worst part about it is when the yeah, challenges just, come in, <laughs> it basically resets my shot entirely. Hand, or what you so I have to, yeah. the first like 50 right, attempts so after the challenge is over, oh, it's basically me shooting for the first time. Oh, 
My pants are just completely <laughs> wet. With the nail. I'm just been a nasty girl. I'm been, I'm been a nasty yeah. girl. It's not even a place in my body that I've only seen this freak. much. I don't know what the hell's going on. I believe in me. Chat was dumb as hell. They kept saying drink water instead of Gatorade. There's a reason marathon runners shouldn't drink just water alone. It dilutes any remaining sodium. You sweat it out and it's dangerous. Overhydration is just another kind of dehydration. You were correct to keep replacing salts and sugar. Yeah. But I didn't do it early on. I should have done it later. This clip became a meme. What? Oh my God. You guys are crazy. Yeah. I, I should have done it earlier. I would have had less cramping. I definitely needed more salt and um all of those like high carb uh runner snacks that marat brought in that came in uh in the clutch for sure i have no care or consideration for my body my entire life i've just like and i've never done like any sort of like ultra marathon or any sort of marathon or anything like that so for me that that's like an entirely different game to make sure that you're you are taking proper care of yourself while doing that is a a, a very specific thing it's a very specific skill even to like be able to protect your body so you can keep going. Cause like I said, my legs are fine. My back is fine. Everything is fine. It's just, what's not fine is, I mean, I have like regular old muscle soreness, but what's not fine is my wrists. And I don't really know if I can do anything about that. Really. It's just like, so what you said about this ruining your relationship with basketball, did it come true? No, it's, I still love basketball. Hopefully as soon as I get, as soon as I get better, like as soon as my wrist gets better, I'll, Get back out in the courts immediately. Hopefully you didn't give yourself carpal tunnel. Hopefully. Ludwig calls you a big boy at the end of this. Ludwig's got to plant those feet and take a charge. 4-2. Man That's handling her. Ludwig more than I do. Oh, my God. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> All right, big boy. All right, big boy. On here, let's just watch the 1v1 at the end here. I don't even know how, I, how well I did, to be honest, because I was... That's my major problem. I want to. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh my god. Here. I like you shoot that. I like you shoot that. I can't move my wrist at all. You can see. Was that a was that an actual three pointer? Wait, hold on. No. Oh, it was. Look at this floater. Ludwig from outside, little fake drives. Why would you think that? Goes for the little land. What are you doing? Hassan Pike. Somehow finding the energy to compete with Ludwig here. His body is falling apart. Like the crumple zone of a NASCAR going look at that. Look at that defense, though. Do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? Almost a steal there. Do you see that? He thinks he can dribble, but he can't. It's joint pain, though, isn't it? In your wrist? No, it's not. I think it's tendon. I can't believe you're this bad. You talk about it all the time. Bad? I'm dead, brother. What are you talking about? This is like the fact that I can still dribble after all of this is crazy, okay? Like, are you kidding me? This is like, look at this, 755. I played two hours prior to this as well. Give my man some shoes, he wins this. I think you guys misunderstand something here. He can wear all the shoes on the planet. This is seven hours in. If he was doing this shit, we were both fresh, it would not be a game. Oh my God. <laughs> Pause. All right, big boy. All right, big boy. Drive him down. That like that dude i'm so dead i'm so dead like i can't believe i'm missing that he blocked my ass that was good look at that look at that look at how weak i am dude it's crazy i got blocked signing a basketball for posterity right now folks Oh. 
Which leg did you injure? Looks like you're limping bad. No, I was just cramping. Anytime I like flexed any muscle, I would cramp at this point. Oh, what a move. So much man. It's called cookies, son. Dude, come on. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Look at that. 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 Come on, dude. You said reach. What do you mean? I snapped it, dude. What are you talking about? He dribbled it into my hand. You Were you right? able to sleep? Like a f***ing baby, dude. It wasn't even a thing. I slept like a goddamn log, okay? The people who wanted to watch this watched yesterday. Take an hour off then, and then you can come back to chat uh, when it's over. I want to watch it. I have no idea what it looked like. I want to watch this now. Nice wig ever show up? He's on camera right now on the left side. I liked it, but I had to stop watching when you were on the ground in pain. Yeah, I was dying a little bit. The amount of pain I was in, every shot felt like just slicing my wrist. Because even my guiding hand, like even my guiding hand was in pain, which is crazy. Because that one is not even like, I'm not even moving it as much. And uh, if it weren't for Will, I, I would not have uh, gone through. After 500, I would have ended, but he caused me to pull through and push through and get another 200. And I'm glad I did because it made me feel a little bit better. If I just like quit at 500, I would have felt real sad about it. We went all the way to the end. Your longest bucket streak. Dude, watching this feels you. painful. 376. Oh my god, he's a god. 377. <laughs> what can't he do? 378. He's just a. He's an adult. He's an Adonis. He's the Greek god of basketball. Oof. Oof. It's just like causing me pain watching this. I'm not even joking. Shot. How's that post traumatic shot disorder? Yeah, no, I, I think I have that. Lamo, they kept missing your buckets when I was watching. I was literally screaming, so invested. Yeah, they were so ADHD, dude. Oh, here's uh, Will hitting a half court shot. That was pretty sick. This is my range now. Leslie and I are pretty sore. We played basketball Bang. yesterday. It's good. See, look, even at 200, I'm already, do you see that? There was another one that Will hit that was pretty sick. I hit 700 th uh, threes. I don't know what my attempt number was, but you could tell, like, even at 200, I'm already, like, trying to, f my wrists are already, like, a little wonky. I don't know what point it was, like, it became unbearable, and I have no idea what my shot percentage looks like, and obviously, the shot percentage is not great because the challenges would reset my shot. You were being passed the ball from the side and not to your chest. That made you break your form every time. Yeah. Missed the beginning of the stream. How's the recovery going? Not great. I was actually losing it because you didn't eat banana or eat some Gatorade. I ha I ate a banana. Uh, all right. Yeah! yeah, I was delirious at this point. She must be really impressed. Yeah. She's really Four. impressed, right? She's like, she yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Nothing more impressive than a sat down <laughs> He took 3,251 shots and landed 700 of them for an accuracy of 21%. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, that's not, that's not a valid percentage because, like, it, that factors me doing these shots and shit. You know what I mean? So I guess, like, for me, I think uh, the best possible way, the best possible way to see my shot percentage would be like maybe the first 300. But even then there were challenges that reset my shot too. So I don't know. And then there's also still the challenges that were, you know, that I was like shooting with my eyes closed with the drunk goggles, shooting underhand, shooting from the ground. I had to shoot with my left hand. Do you want to give this another proper shot without the challenges shit? Not really. 
Because regardless of the challenges and whatnot, like the thing that cooked me was basically my wrists. Like my wrist gave out. And I, that's not copium. I'm just like, I'm just openly admitting that. So yeah, all good fun. Lots of fun was had. Lots of work was put in. Oh, oh, this is uh, this is from wait, how many years ago? August fourth, twenty twenty one. Fuck up Hassan in the one v one. Me and Hassan one v one. He couldn't handle my ass. I would. What's up? I'd box him out. Honestly, half of my technique is to box him out so hard with my ass that he just gets horny and distracted from the game. Because I know Hassan's never been with someone with a dump truck like me. Couldn't handle that ass. I mean, he ain't wrong about losing that. losing his mind on the court. Kind of my tactic. I think Hassan would agree that I beat him in a 1v1. Do you think I'd beat you in 1v1 b-ball? No, of course not, Ludwig. Um, what? Okay, this is legitimately terrifying because if it's what? not... Fair use, which a lot of stuff that we. I would fuck him up. <sighs> That's funny. I just move on from that ridiculous, uh, that ridiculous statement. And then what is but this? Oh, this was the other half court shot that Will made. So you added the one. Oh, I did, I did, I did. I'm, I'm cooked. Look at this. Look at this. It's oh, most a gr granny oh, shot half court. <laughs> What shoes were you wearing on the court? They're kind of droopy. They're the Kyrie Irvings. It's so funny. Every single person was giving me such great advice overall the entire time. And I just refused to listen to them.